Hello guys and welcome back to Tell We Are Channel on YouTube again. So in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to install your own created app from Xcode into your iPhone or iPad. Well, to indicate that if you want to publish your app into App Store, you must have the license agreement from Apple which is requiring you to pay for $99 a year so if, if you can't afford it or you you don't really want to publish your app any anything at all or you just want to only create the app and use by yourself Apple has allowed you to install your app into your own device for free but you must have your Apple developer account registered so for me I already have my Apple developer account registered so I can freely install it on my device once I have finished writing the code of my app so let's get into it so how do you install it, the app into your Apple device well as usual when you have finished coding your app you can run it on simulator in here on the top you can see but you have noticed that there is the word device up here when you're getting up in the simulator bar and you see here it said no device connect to my Mac so if you want to install your app for free into your own device just plug in your device and now I'm gonna plug my device in So I have plugged in my iPad 2 into my Mac. So it load up the iTunes and photo. I'm gonna force quit it because I don't really need to open it at all. Now we're going back to here. You can see it said my name and my iPad has been attached to the machine so I can freely install but before you install it you must have you must check your 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 developing account first whether it is signed in or not so go ahead into quick quiz like here the project the general project click on here and it will show up this this table in here and into the signing section you will see in here if you haven't yet signed in it will asking you to sign in and if you already sign in it will be showing up like that and there is an option in here in the team right here you would have select none or you would have select your personal team but I recommend to but if you're installing on your iPad or something or iPhone or iDevice you must select your personal team in order to get a certificate so click on it and then you have to check for the iOS version of your device for example my iPad is 9.3.5 so I will choose to 9.3 and leave it all right there so now we gotta go so click on here and choose our device and then click on play so when we click on play it will start to build the app that we are currently built it will copy the swift doc and storyboard file and anything and compiling it and install to our i device and this will take a minute not so long
so again guys this is not a simulator this is the real ipad that i have mirror from my ipad into my macbook now i can touch it okay so we will wait for the installation so now you can see in xcode it said installation and it, it might be finished here you can see the quick quiz the quick quiz app but if you are newly installed on your device once you click on open it won't open because you haven't yet trust the certification and if you found it and if the device notify you that you haven't yet trust the certification of your developer account just go into setting and then get into general down there into profile and device management click on it and it will load up the developer app so click on the developer app and there will be a word trust on the delete app section so click on it and it will trust your device and then you will you will be free to install or run your app so now I have already trusted and I can run it so this is my first app and this is how you get your app hands-on on your iDevice for free and thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe